Hey guys, welcome back. Dr. Ko, simplemedschool.com. Today we're going to talk about deep tendon reflexes, the DTRs. So I want to teach you one really simple, super easy way to remember which spinal nerves are being tested as we're testing these deep tendon reflexes. So as you remember, there's the ankle reflex, the knee reflex, your biceps reflex, and your tricep reflex. And they're testing the cervical, the lumbar, and the sacral nerve roots. So which ones are they? How can you remember? Well, one real easy way to do it, you can draw out a diagram just like this. Ankle, knee, bicep, tricep. S1, S2. Sacral 1, sacral 2. L3, L4. Lumbar roots L3 and L4. C5, C6, cervical 5, cervical 6, and finally C7, C8. And it's progressively going up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The ankle, knee, bicep, and tricep. Why is this important clinically? So the there's things that are going to cause hyperreflexia and hyporeflexia. Hyperreflexia, things like brain tumors. Spinal cord lesions, acute strokes, are going to increase the reflexes. Now there's hyporeflexia, botulism, Guillain-Barre syndrome, serotonin syndrome. These are just three of each. There's many things that can cause hypo and hyperreflexia. These are, I just wanted to highlight a few of the more clinically relevant testing uh, type of situations where you'll see it. Hey guys, Dr. Go here. Thanks for joining me, simplemedschool.com. We'll see you next time.